All right, let's just do it. You know, some of my favorite comments that I get on this channel, forgive the hair, I know it's terrible. Uh, they're usually something to the tune of, love this guy's reviews because he's real. Well, I mean, as far as I know, I'm about as human as you can get. Uh, but anyway, I've been planning on, oh, one second. Let's see if I can pause. All right, so, uh, yeah, what I was saying. So I don't really do much editing. I don't really mess with that. Just because people, they kind of, like right now, people are already clicking off because they want me to get to the point. So I'll go ahead and get to that point. So this is a Huano um, keyboard tray under desk kind of thing. And it has been mostly what I wanted. Um, I'd say the main thing I don't like is inside of this, down here on this little sled that you can't really see. Sorry, this phone does not have optic image stabilization. Don't buy a Xiaomi Black Shark. It's an amazing phone for like three things. And then, like, if you've been using a decent phone, you'll be disappointed. Anyway, so it's it's got some play right here just because of the way this tray is designed. Like, it's inside of there. And I thought about adding, like, a poly strip or something. But, honestly, other than that, it's not bad. I mean, it's pretty tight in adjustment. But what makes it special and what I do like about it is you've got a little, like, adjustment knob down here. And, uh... Forgive me, I'm sure I'm just barely in frame, so you're probably just seeing my craptastic hair, and that's about it. You can move this quite a bit upwards. Let's see, am I all the way out? Yeah, so it goes right there. And then you have adjustment here, which I don't know why you do that, but like that. So for you Call of Dutyers and your Fortnite aficionados, this isn't bad. I mean, it's it's a it's not a bad position. Forgive me, the camera's probably shaking. I have you strapped to a. I think it's also made by Moana or what? Moana. I think it's also made by the same company. Um, maybe not, but it's it's very close. Uh, I think it's on the. Yeah, that's Moano, and this is Huano. So forgive me. Anyway, that's what that is. Um, also, it swivels like this. So, like, with me, one thing I like to do um, when it's just me and I'm, you know, lounging, I do like to have my keyboard kind of to the side so that I can kick back. I have this little table that I built a long time ago back here. I made it out of skateboards and scrap lumber. It's probably worth like $10 million now, but anyway, um, so uh, it, being able to turn it like this, I just kind of move my monitor over, I'm good to go. I, I like that. Um, let's see. Looks like, yeah, there's not really on anything on screen that I'm scared to show. I just, I thought about it and I was like, oh wait, is my address up there? It's not. So, anyway. Um, so that's that. That's the keyboard tray. Uh, it doesn't match my desk yet. I haven't really decided what to do. If you could see the rest of this room, you would know that I'm nowhere near complete, but this is this has been a nice addition, so I wanted to say that. Now, let's move on to the Flexi Mount laptop mount. Okay, so the way this works is I've got the covers off right now, but it is actually pretty, pretty sweet the way it works. So you've got your power cable can be tucked away inside of this little thing here. And ooh, I've got way too much tension on that. Let's fix that right now. These things aren't cheap. Oh, my power brick fell. Okay. Well, I need to fix that. That's gnarly. We'll worry about that later. Um, so, <clears throat> the way it works is this little thing right here can pivot this way and that way. And then, of course, you have a swing this way and this way. And then, say, the reason I wanted this is when you're in VR, a lot of times when you need to communicate, you got to get to your keyboard. And I thought that the best way to do that would be to have a computer that can, forgive me, I really want to unplug that power cable so I can assess it. Okay, there we go. I wanted to be able to do that, um, you know, without having to pick the laptop up or worry about pulling it off, because that's actually how it got this crack right here. I think you can see that. It fell off of a bed when I was in a hotel while I was in VR, and uh, I was having sound issues, so I was using headphones plugged in. It's a bad deal. Don't do that. But uh, anyway, so there's a pivot here. It does not want to go. There we go. Like that. 
Um, I've got that just a little over tightened, but anyway, so this will rotate like that. So this gives you a better idea. Forgive me, this, like I said, there's a lot to be done in this room. There's a lot of construction. I'm just not there yet. So you get this. And then the cool thing about it is this has uh, like a tension system in it. You can adjust the tension on it. And this is a pretty heavy laptop. But as you can see, it's pretty functional. Like I, ha I don't have it right to the sweet spot because if I put it kind of in the middle, you know, um, it does kind of want to go down on its own but it's really slow it's not like it's weak it's just out of adjustment but um, I'm still working on that as you can see I didn't even have the power cable slacked up right just yet so it's 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 only been on here for a couple of days but uh, but yeah that's the uh, flex amounts two-in-one monitor arm laptop mount and uh, forgive all the flex and the shake I normally this desk was built kind of under spec on purpose just because I knew that I was going to be mounting it to the wall anyway. So I haven't done that yet since I moved into this room. But that's that. These things have been pretty cool. Um, I thought that I would just do just a just a tandem review, just knock it out real quick, just because uh, there are people that come to my channel to see this stuff, and I haven't been doing that, uh, mainly because I haven't had the money to buy cool stuff. <laughs> But I have been working on my VR, and uh, there's a couple of things that I want to make videos about. I just, uh, the reason I pointed up is because I've got uh, hooks and pulleys and everything in the new setup. I've actually, I am set up now, that's what I'm doing right now, is getting set up for multiplayer VR. Um, and I'm in the, like the final stages of that. But that's that. I won't ramble on any further. Um, peace, guys. Thanks for watching this. And uh, I guess since the subscriber count just keeps going up, um, I haven't really been too focused on YouTube lately. Uh, I just have other things going on. But since it keeps going up, uh, I'll try to figure out a giveaway at, um, let's say, 400 subscribers. It won't be anything much, probably worth $100, but I'll do something uh, just to show that I do care, because it's cool. I mean, I'm glad that people value my opinion enough to listen to me. Um, I don't know. I don't think it's a hair, which I did cut it, so obviously, you know, who knows, maybe all my subscribers will go away. But, uh, Peace, guys. Thanks for watching.